I'm exposed. He's chasing me. I prefer to die than fall in love with someone who pretends to be someone else like you. I found this bomb outside our house. It's about to explode. Yes, I want to leave this country for the rest of my life. I should check the hospitals around here. Episode 19, Escape Plan Stella! She was picked up a day ago. She passed the critical stage and went into a coma. Stella, it's good to see you. But when we wake up... James, is this you? If this is the real James, I've lived with the fake James for the past five years. That's a scary thought. He may imitate James's personality. James, can you remember me? I am your mother. I'm sorry. I don't remember any of it. What happened to me recently was a real surprise. I don't think I'm James Alden. Alice, James has been suffering from memory loss for five years. After dealing with the fake James, we must get James to the doctor. The doctor may somehow restore his memory. Thank you, Scarlet. I regret mistreating you while you were married. You saved James from that fake James. I'm ashamed. Please don't talk like that. My nature as your daughter-in-law is also not good. Scarlet, please forgive me. I don't have a grudge anymore. Do not worry. But how do you know we'll run into problems? Owen warned me that the fake James might do something. Then he asked me to come and save you. Owen is such a good man. He helped us escape the fake James's trap. What should we do now? Should I let the police know? I have investigated. It sounds like fake James bribed cops. We reported to them, but they have no interest in him. Really? Does he dare to do this? He has Mr. Oliver's money. He is a fearsome greedy man. Hello, I'm listening. Scarlet, I found Stella. She's in a coma, though. Also, I know that fake James will leave this country soon. What do you say? If he leaves this country, he will take all of Mr. Oliver's money. But James bribed cops. I don't know what we should do. Wait! Owen! Someone can help! An old friend of mine! She can help us! Who is that? Lady of the Calamar family, Anna Calamar. I will ask her reach out to the police. Hello, Scarlet? It's me. That was a while ago. It must be five years. What do you call me? I need your help. I see. I can't believe you faced all that stuff. I'll help you. Thank you. It's okay. Your family and my family were involved in business as well. When the Brown went out of business, my dad was surprised, too. I know. So how are you now? I am married, but I don't intend to have children. My husband and I are interested in our careers. I see.
Can I have your passport, please? Do you go to Frenzy? That's right. This is your ticket. Please go to the security gate. Why? Why do you impersonate me? You are... I remembered it all. I'm James Alden. You're an imposter. I'm James Alden. I don't know you. Sorry, I have to go. Richard, you got exposed. Don't expect to run away. Alwyn? How can you know I'm here? I know you're about to run. James, or I should call you Richard. For the past five years, you have deceived us. Your wives for impersonating James. You have been exposed. Do you still want to take the entire property of Mr. Oliver? Where is the evidence? Don't slander me. My passport and papers are James Alden. And he's just a guy with the same face as me. He doesn't have an ID at all. If you ever get in the way of me, I'll call the police. You think you can bribe the police with money? What do you mean? Don't pretend you know anything. You bribed cops for ignoring you. We reported your case, but we received no reply. However, we asked someone to help us. What did you say? Who is it? It's me, Anna Calimar. You are Mrs. Anna Calimar of the Calimar family. The Calamar family is a large family with many commercial links to this city. That's right. Given the reputation of the Calamar family, I asked the police to deal with an imposter like you. Why are you doing this? Because my family is friendly to the Brown family. Scarlett and I are old friends. When she asked for my help, I said yes. The person who drove the Browns out of business was you. Richard, you can't run away. This is the flash drive that Stella got the data from your laptop. What? Didn't Stella jump in the river? She was hiding in the grass. This flash drive has a locator connection to my laptop. So I went to the place where Stella disappeared, and I found it. We are police. It's an arrest warrant. Richard Molier, you have been arrested. We believe you killed Tony Logan. If you don't let me leave, the hospital where Stella's brother stays will blow up. What did you say? 